Howdy y'all, welcome back to Iguana Gaming. I'm the Iguana and today guys, we are playing some more Ark Survival Evolved Mobile Edition. Today we are back on our Lone Ranger series and as you can see, we are on our little raptor friend here that we had uh, gotten in the last episode. Um, it was a very long journey down here, but we made it down here, we got healed up. Um, yeah, we are at currently the cave in the south right now. And my goal for today is to get through this cave in the south on this little coyote. And I do have a sleeping bag made up just because this area is like super not very nice. So let's go ahead and place this down just in case we die um, and our coyote friend here is still alive. I definitely want to be able to come back in. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty short cave, but this is a very weak coyote. Uh, there we go. A little bit of loading pains there. All right, so I do have my Ascendant Bow with me. Hopefully we will be able to get in here. Um, I'm hoping as much as possible to kill stuff from a distance with my bow and just get close enough to the artifact to grab it and get back out. I do plan to take the shortest route possible at the moment. Uh, looks like we have a level up actually, which is great. I'm trying to level melee, not that it's gonna help a lot, but um, definitely better than nothing. All right. At the very least, we will have ourselves some levels here. All right, do we have anything bad in this particular area? I'm like waiting for horrible things to come and try to kill me. No, are we okay? We might be kind of okay. All right, so I do have my bow here. I definitely see a scorpion down there. I'm gonna go ahead and throw an arrow at that. Perfect. That was terrible. All right. It's a little bit hard to see them at this point, but um, definitely wanna do as much damage as I can before we get down there because uh, it's very easy to die. All right, got a dung beetle. Oop, spider. All right, we're webbed. We should be able to kill this one. Uh, there's a lot of them, though. Okay, uh, can we... We're webbed, we're webbed. Can we, like, scooch back up here? Nope, 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 nope. Bad, bad, bad. Get up. You can do it. There we go. All right. That's all I wanted. Um, okay, so now we should be able to peacefully check arrows down at these guys if they would cooperate and come into an area where I could actually aim at them. That'd be great. A uh, little hard to see them. Uh, nope, I cannot see anything. This is terrible. Alright, so I know they're all right there. But managing to get an arrow in one of them uh, could be a little bit tricky. I don't think I'm going to have much luck with that. Well, this kind of stinks, but um, we do have 1k health. We might be okay since these are just spiders. We're going to have to try it. Luckily, everything in this cave is like kind of a low level at the moment. This is great. All right, let's just hit as much as we can. Okay. 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 Cool. Um, we're doing great. <laughs> Definitely making me nervous, but we actually didn't lose as much health as I thought we would, so I think we're okay for the moment. Um, again, I can't see super well. Alright, scorpions could be a problem. Especially this one, because it seems to be a high level. Alright, let's just draw the bow. There we go. Definitely hard to see in this cave without the torch. I'm really glad I brought a torch, but I'm also super nervous that we are going to get just slaughtered here any moment. Um, again, I'm not super worried about, like, spiders. It's snakes and arthropleura that I'm a little bit worried about. Uh, the snakes can be a big pain. Currently, we're not losing that much health, which is great. Even though this is a super, super low-level coyote. All right, let's go. Come on. All right, getting rid of our spiders. Uh, all right, well, we made it past that. Anything coming after us? I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Alright, bow's out. 
torch out. There's a snake. Snake. Nope, nope, nope. All right, let's go turn around. Turn around. Okay, so these snakes should be coming at me in just a second here. As should the scorpion. Come on, draw my bow. That would be helpful. There it is. All right, got that. Got that. Is there anything else coming at me? Perhaps from this direction. I do want to keep checking behind me so to make sure that my uh, raptor doesn't die. Alright, if there's a snake in here, I'm in trouble. Alright, let's grab this super fast and then get out of here. I think we did it. We have the artifact. Um, getting out of here could be a whole different story, but hopefully nothing too bad is spawning in right next to us. All right, I think we're okay. Oh my gosh, super tense. <laughs> super tense. Uh, getting up this hill is always a little bit tricky as well. There we go. Perfect. Um, cool, so we did it. We made it out, which is great. Um, there shouldn't be too many other creature spawns up here now that we've got the artifact and we're headed out of the cave. Now the trick is, is that we are going to have to go... Um, to an obelisk. A uh, green obelisk is obvious since that is where our horses are, so we'll probably try to head back over there rather than go to red obelisk, which is technically closer. Um, and I just have to hope that we get a really good loot drop from this particular artifact. I think that would be super handy. All right, let's go ahead and run out here. All right, got myself a thousand XP. Don't think we're going to need that. Okay, so it's a long run back. Um, I'm going to try to stick to the southern isles and the rivers as much as possible because it's a little bit safer. Um, dang it, Dark Knight's not going to be an option here. I may have to just hang around and wait for it to get light because this lighting is honestly awful. Actually, what time of day is it even? Yeah, it's getting pretty late. I may just go ahead and um, hang out here for a little bit, wait until it's daylight, and then... Um, yeah, I guess I can bring you guys back when uh, when we are ready to carry on. So I will see you guys in just a little bit here. Okay, guys, so we are back and it is just about daylight here. So I do think we're going to go ahead and try to start the run back to Green Ob. Um, now it is quite a ways, unfortunately. And our raptor's pretty low level, but hopefully, hopefully we'll get back there without too much incident here. All right, let's go ahead and take off. First things first, we got to get out of the canyon to where we can hopefully see a little bit better here. There we go. It's lightening up a little bit as we leave this area. Perfect. Okay, cool. So our raptor is also a little bit slow, so this could take a little bit of time here. Um, I'm just hoping we don't run into anything too horrible out here. Otherwise, we could be in some serious trouble. All right, there we go. Perfect. All right, so I am going to try to cross... Um, basically along the southern isles here avoid the swamp area because that could be pretty bad for us and then uh yeah we'll try to slowly make our way back up the river to green ob i think that's going to be like the best course of action here hopefully yeah that that bull could be bad news all right let's go this way hopefully we don't run into anything too terrible here all right a bunch of pack mules we're good there All right, um, out of stam. That's gonna be something we're gonna have to watch as well. Luckily, not too bad. All right, how close are we? We are still quite far away from another level, unfortunately. All right, let's keep going. Man, I do wish we had a higher level coyote, but um, I'm still pretty happy that we were able to get in and out of the cave without instant. That's kind of uh, not always the easiest thing. There's another one. We'll go ahead and keep running so we can avoid that. All right, let's just go. Better to put some distance between us and anything bad that I see. All right, let's keep moving this way. Now, I do think at the intersection of all these rivers, there were some bad things, if I recall correctly. There was um, a spino and some other stuff, so we're gonna have to be pretty careful getting by it. Definitely don't wanna meet it. 
We didn't have too much trouble on the way here, but um, coming back we might have a little bit more problems. Hopefully not, though. All right. Cool, those bugs are going to come at us. No, we're good. For some reason, the ants aren't attacking us. That's fine. I'm okay with that. They, that can stay the way it is. All right. Still quite a ways away. Man, raptors, um, they're a little bit slower than I had originally thought they might be. They're quite a bit slower than a horse, but um, they are also a little bit more hardy in terms of not dying. <laughs> so I am glad I have this one, but man, it is, uh, it is quite the trip back. All right, we're getting pretty close to the river junction here. Um, yeah, actually, shockingly looks okay. I don't see anything too bad in this area. We're just gonna go ahead and run across here. And then we should be pretty close to getting back to our little mountain cabin. And now I do think, guys, that we need to, oh, that is not what I wanted to see. I'm just gonna run. I don't know how I can go any faster, but hopefully that thing is not chasing us. Shockingly, shockingly we stood right next to it and it did not chase us. Um, I'm actually very okay with that. All right. <laughs> this might be a less eventful trip than I thought it would be, which is great. Uh, there's another one over there, but I'm gonna ignore that. I'm also going to ignore that. We're just gonna go. Uh, yeah, cool. All right, we're doing it. Oh man. Yeah, guys, so uh, I did not fully expect this coyote to survive, but now that it has and that we're almost back at our temporary base here, I do think we need to build this thing a doghouse. So we're probably going to do that in the next episode. Build it a little house all of its own. We can keep this guy out back so he's got a little space, um, and hopefully that will work out just fine. All right. So close, so close. I feel like I'm not quite in the clear yet. Nope. All right, stamina is a problem. Now we do actually have to get all the way over to Green Obelisk, which is um, a little bit more of a challenge since that does mean we're gonna have to go around and uh, actually down into the entrance of the Green Obelisk area, which is not the easiest thing to get to because there's really only one major entrance. We could actually probably just jump down from here Let's actually do that. Okay, hurt a little bit, but not too bad. Cool, all right, that actually worked out better than I thought, so we should be able to jump up here. Um, is that it? Can I get up here? I feel like there should be a way up here. I feel like this looks like a path up, but apparently it's not. All right, let's go ahead and run around. I know there's a path up here somewhere. Still got to tribute this artifact. I want the XP, and I do think we seriously need the, um... Is that not the way up? <laughs> All right, so I do think we seriously also need the uh, blueprints that we will hopefully get from this whole process. There's a lot of bad stuff down there. All right, uh, let's go ahead and run around. That's another coyote over there. I don't want to mess with that. Cool, so apparently that was not the best way to get in here, but, um... It worked out, hopefully. Oh man, we're still so slow. Horses are quite a bit faster, even when they're even when they're not the fastest horses that you can get. Right, can we get just around here? Alright, got ourselves some pigs. Alright. Some little ankle biters. I love those. Okay. Cool, so this should be the proper entrance here if we can get through the bugs. Uh, why is this a bad area? I don't like that this is a bad area. I was really hoping it wouldn't be a bad area. Let's just keep going. There wasn't too much bad on the platform, so we should be okay once we get up here. Uh, or not. That's fine. Is it all the bugs? It might just be the Meganura, honestly, because the Meganura, the little dragonflies, definitely can cause problems. All right. I think we're okay. I don't see anything super bad on the platform. Nope, just a monkey. We're good. All right, let's go ahead and hop off here. Uh, now, I am going to go ahead and start the pursuit for this tribute, just so that we get the XP, because I do think we could use that. All right, what do we get?
Perfect. All right. So, um, that actually works out great. I did get some blueprints for armor, which is fantastic. Those pants are terrible, but they have good durability. Uh, the boots are a little bit better, so I'm really happy about those. And then we also have this Ascendant Metal Pick, which is great. I'm definitely going to have to craft that up pretty soon here. Yeah, okay. So that's not too bad. I think we can definitely manage that. Um, that'll be great because we definitely did need better armor. It's been um, it's been a long time that I've been running around in these cloth pants, and uh, it's not quite good enough. All right, guys. So um, I do think that that is actually going to do it for today's episode. Uh, that actually went shockingly well on our little coyote friend here, so I am going to pick a name. Um, I thought, honestly, that we would die, so I haven't picked a name for this guy yet, but I definitely will before the next episode. We're going to build this guy a little dog house, and um, yeah, we'll just keep on keeping on with the series, guys. So, if you did find yourself enjoying this video at any point, please do remember to hit that like button because it seriously helps me out. And if you want to see more content like this, you can, of course, subscribe. I will catch you all in the next one. Signing off, this is The Iguana. <laughs>